Here's a beginner habit you really need to stop doing. Stop thinking about strumming like this. Down, up, down, up. Oh shit. Uh... This is cute for beginners, but as you go deeper in your guitar playing journey, you really ought to ditch this noob shit. I've talked about this in a video on my channel before, but it was in a short and therefore only 60 seconds. Some noobs in the comment section really got pissed off, but since I'm the nicest guy in the world, I figured I would clear things up for you. Those downs and ups really represent the rhythm, but these terms do not specify the duration of each strum. If the duration of each strum was half notes or two beats, it'd sound like this. If the duration of each strum was quarter notes, or one beat, it would sound like this. If the duration of each strum was eighth notes, or half a beat, it would sound like this. If we write out the rhythm, we know exactly how long each strum lasts for. Let's look at some examples! In order to scrap this noob down up bullshit, one has to understand these things. But what's the best way to learn this stuff, Brandon? Listen carefully to strum patterns in a song and try to recreate them with your guitar. Everybody seems to think that ear training is just practicing a bunch of intervals. There's a lot more to it than that. You see what I did there with those examples? Why don't you try to figure out the strum patterns of these songs? Oh no, but that will require effort. And I know you guys can't do that. Poor baby. Subscribe to my channel for being a nice guy. Age reveal at 1 million subs. You can also learn how to read rhythms. This takes even more effort. But at the end of the day, what are you trying to do with guitar? If you want to strum songs at a campfire, then I would definitely recommend trying to learn strum patterns by ear. But learning to read them is not necessary. 52-week guitar players closed for enrollment until mid-June. We just closed on March 31st, so now is a super early time to get on the waiting list. But is 52-week guitar player a good fit for beginners? The program is aimed more at intermediate level guitar players. I cover all the beginner stuff, yes, but I cram a lot of beginner information into a few lessons, since usually the people enrolling in the program have some experience. They can usually play open open chords and know the pentatonic scale, for example. But we've had beginners join in the past and it didn't seem to be too much of a problem for them. You're still gonna learn shit. Just remember, if you see people progressing through the lessons quicker than you, that it's not a race, goddammit. Click the link in the description for more info. Now just leave!